What's up guys, welcome to Aries Moto Home with a quick and easy where nothing is quick, definitely not easy. Welcome, welcome, welcome 2012 Nissan Sentra. Uh, what happened was the lady that was driving it, the ball joint fell out and then she wrecked the axle shaft, fell out, made a big boo-boo. So we're gonna be going step by step up to replace axle shaft. Uh, ball joint. So as you can tell, we're working on the ground right now. Uh, old man is just putting ball joint in so we can get it to the hoist. you manage to oh you just okay. Okay, so what old man is doing right now is trying to pry out or hammer out the bottom part of the ball joint Put it up. Raise the car. Uh, you're gonna remove the, the rubber. Yeah. Is it out? Okay, awesome. And so far, old man used a piece of pipe that fits around right here. So when you hammer on a ball joint, you can actually drop. This is just a metal piece, two of them, air chisel. But you can use a hammer and regular chisel WD-40 and screwdriver that's about it and here's the here's the axle shaft and the one right here broken so you're gonna have to be pushing it in okay so old man brought the ball joint tool you can rent one of those at your local AutoZone, I think. I know the part source here in Canada also rents tools. So you're gonna just press that in. All right, so finally the old man found the right size. A little metal piece so it can be pressed in by hand. You also want to make sure like when you're doing that that the, your press sort of if you want to call it is leveled so the one side is not going in so it doesn't get jammed. Hello.
Okay. All right. Wall drain is in. Let's see that thing. You see? Yep. Same distance. And now there's a bolt. How is it? 14, 15. Putting a security ring. And then once you put it on, you want to spin it a little bit just to make sure it's placed correctly. Yeah, it's seated correctly. Let's see you down. I'm gonna grab this thing to the garage while I'm gonna put it. Put that on. 